Hello, I just wanted to give everyone an update on my experiment in trying to synthesize uracil from malic acid and urea. It has been very interesting to say the least. Uh, first, I mixed the malic acid and urea with a sulfuric acid solution as described in my last video. Upon addition of sodium bicarbonate to neutralize the acid, the solution separated into two phases, an aqueous phase which was the upper layer, and a nonpolar phase, which was the bottom layer. The two layers were almost uniform in terms of color and clarity, and so it was very hard to tell them apart. So I got the idea of adding blue food coloring uh, to the aqueous top layer so that I could see the two layers more easily. I had the solution in a separatory funnel at this time, and so I simply drained off the lower layer into a beaker. I got approximately 60 milliliters of solution, which was about the same amount that I had started with in the original experiment. Uh, actually, actually, that was slightly more. Uh, I then put the liquid in the beaker in the freezer to see if I could separate any liquid ice from any co other contents of the beaker. Uh, what happened next was totally unexpected. When I took the solution out of the freezer and thawed it, what I got was this gel-like substance, uh, similar to what you would get if you cooked a chicken and then put it in the refrigerator overnight. Um, I'm very intrigued by this result. I'm not sure what this gel substance could be, but I will carry out this test for uracil once I obtain the reagents to do so. Uh, anyway, thanks for watching, and be sure to like and subscribe as always. Thanks.